hi guys how are you you are welcome to my youtube channel my name is mkisa queen from uganda but currently working in saudi arabia as a home nurse or you can call me a caregiver or bedside nurse <laughs> how are you doing if you're watching me for the very first time please i kindly request you to subscribe to my youtube channel and please don't forget to click on the notification bell so that whenever i upload a video you get to be notified about it and i really want to appreciate everyone that always takes their time to watch my video from the beginning up to end i really appreciate everyone that comments gives me a thumb i really appreciate you guys do me a lot and that keeps me moving every new subscribers you are dearly welcome and trust me if you are still a small youtuber like me trust me girl oh boy <laughs> i'm sorry for calling you people boys but trust me i'm gonna return you know i'm gonna return and mm -hmm, if you have not yet returned please do <laughs> oh my god okay 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 breathing out yeah so guys today i want to talk about pretense by the way how do i look guys give me a note down below that i wish i could stand so that you see my dress this is my new gift from my omi i'll call her omi um in arabic omi means mom so this is my new dress <laughs> so guys i'm gonna talk about pretense pretense what do you know about pretense oh my god pretense a lot of people like pretending people are li we are living in a fake generation i'm sorry to call it fake though we are living in a generation where people are living a fake life people are pretending too too much we are living in a generation it's like the world is now coming to an end yeah the way things have changed in this generation we are in it's so alarming pretense is where some so it's pretense is where someone acts or puts up something to be true while it is not true you know we are living in a world of pretense people have stopped doing things according to god's commands black people are bleaching becoming to brown people are changing their identity every now and then transgender people a man turning into a woman a woman be turning into a man things have really changed another thing like things of women you know women loving women lesbianism like a lot of things have changed we are living in a fake life people are pretending too much people have turned from what they were supposed to, to <coughs> do or do and are doing the opposite men are marrying men you know everything is just i don't know things are no longer true the way they were supposed to be you find someone calling themselves men of god and yet they come and preach in church they call jesus you find an imam in the mosque talking about allah's name but they do the opposite they preach about god talk about god but they do the opposite they believe in another idol that they call god and in church or mosques they talk of god people are pretending you find married people you are married you are married to a man or a woman for 10 years but at the end of the day you people are having kids and a woman wakes up in the morning and tells you these kids are not yours or you were wedded in church the bible says you'll always get married to one person a man and a woman a man marries one woman after years you get to know that your husband has like some other 10 women you know and they've done traditional marriage for that matter you don't know anything 
so the world has turned into something else. Pretense is just everywhere. It is too much. But where do you belong? Are you among those categories I've named? Because there are so many. I know I cannot finish them. Fake friends, like people pretend you, 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 you find someone pretending to be your friend, like your friend, your good friend, yet that same person blacks blackmails you when you don't you know that is the same person that talks behind your back when you don't know but when you're together they pretend to be your good good friend your sweethearts some people call them best friends all my life i've grown up to to this age but i think there is only one person and i can never sit that much and i say i have a best friend you know to me, my best friend has always been God. Not even my parents, by the way. God. Ever since I grew up, I always tell people, how do you people do it to have a best friend? Like, this is my best friend, my bestie, my... How do you people do it? Because I've seen a lot of things in this world that really shook my heart. And there's some things I look at, I'm like, oh, you know? And I'm not surprised. Because... Everything is pretense in this world. Most people are pretending. Most people are pretending. But did you know that pretense is a sin? Pretense, you can do whatever thing you do on this earth. It is okay. It is okay for us because we are all here. But just know everything you're doing. There is one person up there. You can never lie to that man. Is the only person that sees deep inside your heart. You can smile with me right now. Do you know someone can smile with you, serve you a plate of food, smiling, but when that person has poisoned that food, you know? Someone smiles with you and gives you a cup of coffee, but in that coffee, he or she has put poison for you. You can do all that, but there is always that one person high above. Hi above who sees everything who sees everything so why are why while you're doing all this stuff do them knowing there's someone up there that sees do you want your soul to continue suffering to continue suffer on earth and even when you go to heaven still you still go through the same pain because i for me one thing I, I know, you can pretend all you want when people are around. But when you get to your room and you're alone in your bed, that is when you get to know how painful it is. And I know whoever's going to watch this video. I don't know. But if you've ever gone through this or you're doing this, I know you know what I'm trying to mean. You can pretend all you want, but deep down your heart, you also know the truth. It is you and your God, because on earth, there is no secret. There is no secret on this earth. The reason why they say there is no secret, because there is that God that is already seeing everything. I may not see it. You may deny it, but for him, you can never deny it, because he's the one who created you. You know, he's the one who created you. You are a man. Why do you have to transfer to transfer yourself to a woman. You have a friend that loves you. Why do you have to pretend? Why do you have to hate that person and pretend that you're their friends when you're not? Seriously, it is not good. You can pretend all you want to pretend, <laughs> but there is time. That time is coming and you'll be the only person to answer for it. So, as much as, as you people say, we are on earth, we shall see when I've gone. If I die, then I will see what comes in the next generation. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I wish, I always say, I wish those people that died, like, could come back and always tell us that, oh, queen, please, if you're doing this, so change your, because what we are seeing here, for you, you don't know, but it's unfortunate that they cannot come back. So I'm just here to tell someone out there that pretense is a sin. You can pretend all you want, but that pretense is not good. In the, in the holy books, it is not good. In the Bible, it is not good. You can read Luke 19. 
it is not good pretense is not good be who you are god had a reason to why he created you in that way you find people in the same family same mother same father and they all pretend to be sisters and brothers let me say they pretend to be sisters and brothers and yet with your sister and brother you're supposed to love each other and support but you find them fighting each other like nothing they pretend to be loving each other but when someone goes away they start backbiting that person oh this person oh this person you get and yet family is love if you cannot love yourself as sisters and brothers who is going to love you if she has not started in your family if you people in the same family hate yourself that much then do, do, what do you expect from other people they always say charity begins from home so guys pretense is not good like pretense is a bad sin a real sin it is a real sin you're a man out there vibing different girls pretending to be loving them yet you also know that the bible recommends one person you have to get married to one person you are a woman you know you're supposed to settle with one person but you're lying to 10 men 20 find women having like 20 boyfriends you know all for what pretense is something that is very painful you may pretend to have all those men at the end of the day one of them is going to make you pregnant and you'll get confused you end up giving back to a bastard just because you're pretending and getting money from all of them you end up making your kid to suffer just because of the mother's stupidity you know a young man you pretend to be having a lot of women sugar mommy the young ones and the old ones you will end up getting AIDS and you spend the rest of your life taking medicine or even dying at a young age just because we're pretending because you wanted to show off amongst your friends for me i can put on good clothes for me i can hold iphone 13 that you, you cannot even afford just because you want to appear or fit in the group of your friends you're selling your soul at the end of the day you will be the one to suffer i told you pretense is good oh it is good to those that think it is good, but it is bad because why does it become bad that at the end of it all, you're the only person that feels the pain most when you're alone. You can pretend when people are there. Yes. And everyone will, yeah, queen, go, queen, go. Oh, when they all go. That is when you sit and you're like, why did I do this? You know, why? Why did I do this? Live your life. Live that real life you're supposed to live. Stop pretending to be who you not stop pretending to hurt others pretends pretense can cause to death depression stress like pretense causes a lot of things you're going to pretend be to, to be loving someone at the end of the day you're broken that person is hurt you know because to you it is fun that person can even die because of stress because they loved you so much you know a lot of people are broken down because of pretense and yet it is other people doing that so if you know you've been doing this please stop because in the eyes of god it is not right it is not right to stop live a real life if you, even if you have one shirt and one trouser always wash them at night put them all on during the day wash them at night they will dry and you'll still put on the next day and you still be smart be comfortable where you are. Stop living that pretense life because you want to fit in society. Mind you, we uh, we even we were all born on different days, different times. Even twins, there are no twins that have ever come out on the same time. You know, there is always the one who comes first and then the one who comes last. So there is always time for everything. If you know you've been pretending, doing bad to other others, pretending to love to be loving them yet you don't, please repent. Repent. There is always time for 
everything that is why they always tell us to pretend every time every minute every second because you don't know what is going to come next so my sister my brother repent stop pretending it is not good please if you're watching me for the very first time like for the very first time or you've always been watching me and you you watch my videos halfway please watch my videos till the end support me share this video there are a lot of people that need to hear such such words that need to be advised they don't have anyone to advise them but when someone hears such a thing he's gonna be blessed so be a blessing into someone's life by sharing my videos with other people if you're watching me for the very first time please subscribe to my youtube channel i love you so much i'm kisa queen the northern bay from uganda oh my god bless you for me i'm out